see all of you. I'm not in the Philippines right now. I'm here in Taiwan and this for already two weeks. Ina and I, we are attending a seminar here. So it's actually quite busy time and I don't get to see the country very much. But there are a few things I learned already about this country. So the next couple of videos will be about Taiwan, about the culture, about the country, and maybe even a little bit of a comparison between the Philippines and Taiwan. That's happening like all the time. I think they're using fireworks on the rice fields to get rid of the birds. But today I want to share with you one story that I experienced here in Taiwan. One of the most humiliating stories I ever experienced in Taiwan. Intro. Great. Just use the time of the intro to subscribe to this channel if you aren't already and to like the video. It actually does make a difference. And so you also make sure not to miss out on the next videos. The story. I just finished my morning run and then doing some stretching exercises when an elderly woman walks up to me, tucks it in my sleeve and says, I don't understand Chinese, so I'm wondering what she wants from me. I'm quite surprised when she starts to do some stretching exercises too. She's friendly, but she laughs at me when she sees that I'm struggling. <laughs> Apparently, even the older people in Taiwan are quite agile. But there's also something we can learn from the story. We all start small, we all start in the beginning, we all just can do stuff step by step. So don't be afraid to embarrass yourself. Don't be afraid to start small. Just start somewhere, even when people will laugh at you or something. Just try not to think about this, just try to improve day by day. Don't let yourself pressure by other people. For me it was kind of a fun story, but it felt embarrassing that in whatever 70 year old grandma is more agile, more flexible with her body than I am. But the only thing I can do is just do my exercise every day, to stretch every day, and then over time I will improve. So I want to encourage you to do the same thing. So this was just a little story out of my daily life here in Taiwan right now. Now I will show you a little bit about the beauty of Taiwan. This is a trash truck or rubbish truck or however it's called in your country. They're driving around here every day, every morning, with this funny little song. People are going out of their houses and bring their rubbish to the truck. That's how Taiwan deals with rubbish. Actually really cool. Great day, enjoy your life, see you next video.